Today we are looking at the Cobra SWD M11-9. The story with this would begin back in 1964 with arms designer Gordon Ingram, who would come up with the M10 open bolt submachine gun distributed by Military Armament Corporation, or MAC. Now the Military Armament Corporation would see success with these for about a decade, but they would start losing sales and go into bankruptcy. They would sell off a majority of their tooling and parts to a company known as RPB. They would come out with a semi-automatic open bolt configuration of this firearm. However, in 1981, the ATF would decide that open bolt semi-automatic pistols are too easily converted into fully automatic machine guns. So in 1982, they had to cease production on the open bolt Mac pistols. And they would sell off the remaining parts and tooling for these pistols to a former employee known as Wayne Daniels. They would cooperate with Cobra and coming up with a new semi-automatic closed bolt configuration of this pistol, which they would sell until 1994 when the assault weapons ban would go into place prohibiting further manufacture of this design.